Hello, I'm Ms. Broind and this is Avina and we're going to teach you some outdoor art and mindfulness. Today in outdoor art and mindfulness we're going to show you how to make a nature scavenger hunt. You mm -hmm. will need paper, pencil, school book, and googly eyes. Yes, we'll show you what that's for later. The first thing we're going to do is create sort of a bingo board full of things that we might see on an outdoor explore. One important message about our drawings of our scavenger hunt list before we get started. These are not supposed to be exquisite pieces of art that you would send to the Metropolitan Museum. You just need to draw a little symbol and maybe even a word of what you're looking for. Sound good? Mm -hmm. No stress. So when you have your paper and your pencil, you are ready to start to make your low stress, no fuss symbols of what we're going to look for. So let's think about what we might see on our explorer. Um, flowers. Flowers. If you're drawing with someone, don't draw in the same box as them. So are you gonna draw in that box? I'm gonna put flowers over here then. I'm just drawing a quick little flower and I'm gonna label it flower. And if I see a flower on our hike, I'll cross it off. I think we might see mushrooms. I'm gonna draw a mushroom down here. Make sure we include a smooth stone. This is very important. Smooth stone. We're gonna do something really special with your smooth stone. Take a little dab of glue and put your googly eyes right on your rock. You wanna show them how yours look now? Hello. <laughs> These are really silly, and it's a good little reminder of what? To look around. Yeah, I think sometimes we get swept away in other, other things in our mind, and we're not just looking at the nature around us. So maybe put this in a garden near your house, or like we could put ours right by our steps to always remind us to keep our eyes open, to notice what's around us. It never us. closes its eyes. It never closes its eyes. We're allowed to blink. <laughs> So I just want to show you, this one's Avina's, and this one is mine, and we didn't make any of our things in the same spots, and we even decided that we don't have to do all the same things. Like, she decided she wanted to look for a caterpillar, and I didn't have space for that on mine, and that's totally okay. The cool thing is that when, um, when we go on our explore, we can all win. We can all get bingos, right? Mm -hmm. It kind of gives you, like, something to look for while you're on your hike or walking around your yard and it's pretty fun. Bye. 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 Hope you had fun. Bye.